I was a senior in high school in 2014 and I graduated, never really thought about college a whole lot and so I went and I traveled the world. I got to go to New Zealand for a few months, South Korea for a few months, Mexico and then when I was actually pursuing film I got a call from my mom that said your younger sister is being recruited to play basketball at an all-women's college in Nevada, Missouri. And I was like, that's awesome for her. And she was like, yeah, and the coach wants you and your older sister too. I sent in some videos of me playing basketball and all three of us got recruited to play basketball. So that's how I, it was coincidence, I guess. It just kind of fell into my lap. So Coach Beeson and Blakely, my assistant coach, I think they really see greatness in their players and they see their potential. And when you have a coach that sees that in you, it really inspires you to do the best that you can do. I think there's a lot of different times where, you know, we can give examples that we've been proud of our athletes. I think the biggest one whenever it comes to me is being able to see the growth that our athletes have had from their freshman year that they, when they have entered Cotty versus whenever they end up graduating with their degree at the end of their time of stay at Cotty. Cotty has a lot of great opportunities through LEO programs, obviously being involved in athletics, and it's just the amount of growth that they have from year one into year four at Cotty. I was a little bit older coming in. I also was homeschooled growing up, and so I wasn't used to big classroom sizes, even in the public school setting. So coming in to small classrooms, one-on-one -on -one time with professors, all the professors, they know you by name. They know what you struggle with, what you're strong in. They can call out um, skills and abilities in you maybe that you didn't even see in yourself. So Cadi was a really great fit for me, academically, athletically, kind of all the way around.